so what's up guys, I'm back with today, got a really quick um, talk about video, I'm going to do the really quick, I'm going to go over everything for the 5 anniversary, everything overall for the 5 anniversary, I did for JP a couple days ago, Um, I did a video like months and months ago, after the anniversary ended, anniversary is pretty much over for global, I'm going to go over everything really quick, I'm going to mix the video as fast as I can now, again, I'll leave this video out whenever I feel like it, because I'm um, not really, whenever I feel like it, but I try to get this video out as soon as I can though, my head's kind of hurting a little bit, so um, I don't know, just being kind of weird. But of course, though, I'm going to go over everything for the 5 year anniversary overall. Lots of new stuff that came out for the 5 year anniversary, lots of new gimmicks and stuff like that. We'll see probably in the future or come back later. So, yeah. Um, first thing first, we have um, a new Elder's Monster Goku Black from Zero was playing. That was a new story event. I really call it Zero Wallets playing. And I mean, yeah, I always make the hashtag Zero Wallets playing. Um, we got a new three Saiyans by Fate, even though we can only get two of them, not new three. Because that Goku, it looked like art right there for Goku. They never really did for some odd reason. I feel like they should have did that because, you know, keep Goku from the probably movie would have been cool. I don't know. Um, we have a new um, equipment slash skill whip stuff that I did make a separate video for. I've not uploaded that video yet. I'm going to do it sooner or later, though, um, for Global. Because I am going to do a Global um, update video, and I'm going to do the, um, I'm going to do a Global update video. Then I'm going to do, um, I'm going to upload JP and Global's video at the same time for JP and Global. Because I'm way behind on JP. Again, I've just been caught up on recordings and stuff like that a lot lately, um, for me. We got a new boss rush question if you're Dragon Ball Sage. I know you I know the time's recording. I think Gold was gonna get you kept plus soon, so um we're gonna see like either for six and stuff like that in stage eight, I think. Um I know Gold was gonna start that, that kind of stuff earlier. Of course we got new Smash right there, but like into LR. And we we'll probably kinda of need to like you know skim a live stream and stuff like that. Kinda of like early live stream, we all kinda of knew that was gonna happen. Um anyway, um of course we got a new Frieza um um work uh, how does that Frieza work day? Oh my gosh, Frieza um, in employment like you know um test phases with her go on. It's a Hercule punch bag machine right again. In the Hercule stacking event, we're basically doing the stage. I'm doing the damage you can with this like, category. And boom, you got like, stones, rewards. I do like those type of events. For a down celebration, the probably will bring that back because that really was fun. You can't trade for anything. Like, Towels from Hercule, you can't trade that for anything. Of course, Gobble got a lot of new stuff. But the same thing as almost like JP, though. Almost, around the same stuff. They never really changed anniversary stuff. Of course, right here we had new Log and Bones Goku. Um, they never really talked about it. He's really good, though. He's really good. He's probably the best, like, you know, login, you know, anniversary event ever. He's really good. If you have, if you have, if you have any more from a guy options or any good options from the gods or whatever, he's really good. Of course, we got the loser Goku, we got the, um, you know, we got the winner, winning and losing versions of you know, global and stuff like that. Every download celebration, or you know, every big, um, you know, fighting. Universe. I think every download celebration we usually got one. So, um, of course, for Yamcha, I think that was like 200 million. Um, Goku was, um, no, I think Kirk was 300, three, um, 300 million, three mil. Goku was 250 million, and um. I got you too late. Because they had those cards in the games for the years and stuff like that, but we didn't know what they were doing before. Um, for Yamcha and Vegeta. Of course, um, for Yamcha, there's a bad and Vegeta crown part, which you can't go on Global right now. And for um, Global, you can get the losing Frieza, which is good. It's not like losing that much. Um, he's really good, though. And of course, Hercule has um, sales. So yeah, I'll get those as soon as I can, though. Um, I know Global got lots of new stuff, of course. We got um, new stages for a new two new LRs that um, were kind of looks like confirmed. Um, LR Gogeta and Vegeta, of course, the first of their kind. They really are good units, though. Yeah, of course, though. Um, Again, it was like new, lots of new awakenings. A lot of people were sad because they weren't any old awakening because these are all completely new. Um, I kind of am like that too, a little bit salty. It's like you could have your awakening with new, new units. I knew a 5 year anniversary battlefield, which I did do a video on. Some of you see on the, um, the Zero Mortals plan, and of course the Saiyan. Um, this um, 3 Saiyan by Fate event got updated. And of course, we got a new ZA with that update. We got LL Goku Black, Tomasu. We got. Um, Broly, um, Broly, not Broly and Bob, just regular Kid Broly, Shipping Broly and Bob. Of course, Kate Rides and Kate Vegeta, the guy with things and stuff like that. Um, we got a new LR Broly, Chile, and Limo, on the new um, first kind of LR, which are really good. Uh, Goku Black, and of course, you know, we got Universe, uh, we got uh, Goku Black, first ever LR DCA. Of course, we got, um, um, the new infantry Dragon Ball stages. But yeah, again, I'm gonna go over all that really quick, though. I'm not gonna spend too, too long this video. I shouldn't, though, but it doesn't really matter, though. But yeah. I'm going to all the stuff for the um, anniversary though. Um, again, I did this for JP. I'll put the video somewhere around here. Like, I did the videos like months ago, so I did that video specifically months ago though. But, yeah, um, it's pretty much it for the value anniversary overall. Like for that though, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna end the video here though because there's still a lot of stuff I still want to talk about. Though, of course, but yeah, um, that's pretty much everything bigly we got in um, you know everything month though. So the goal we got like five thousand yo. Know, um, um, Facebook and stuff like that campaigns. JP always just got those as well. Twitter campaigns, Facebook campaigns. It's basically the same thing. Over got a lot of those. And I'm gonna scroll down because I did videos for those already. Again, I look all the five university videos for Global up above and I. Up above, we need to get that clear on presentation. Um, representation. Um, res. I can't even say anything. Presentation of it. I'll say presentation of it. Um, and I, well, I'll link all the five anniversary videos around me. What I did for JP. Show. Again, there's gonna be somewhere around here. I'm not gonna forget those. I definitely will not forget. Them. Um, yeah, of course we had the countdown campaign for um, Global, of course, um, you know, with new LR and stuff like that. Everybody was hyped. We had, um, you know, just logging bonuses and stuff like that. We had, um, returning campaigns for people who, um, 
we're basically you know, in the game and stuff like that, basically, um, we're kind of like, um, okay, you know, you quit the game, come back. So basically, it was kind of like that. We got, um, one more prep, of course, we got one tournament. I was gonna, like, Global's gonna get World Tournament, but they never do it for anniversary, so Global kind of pushes a little bit early because Mega Freeze and stuff like that. And then we got like, World Tournament prizes and stuff like that, typical stuff right here, that's really kind of it there. And all Joker Fest were open and stuff like that, and we got time for XP, so the Battle Royale is still open though. Um, five minutes of three stamina, and I think all the shop stuff. And, you know, typical little stuff we always get. We got Trooper XP, which I always recommend doing that on the anniversaries. But for Dallas Operation, we're gonna definitely see that, because I think they had that last year. Um, so we, yeah, we're gonna see, probably see, like, Town 4. I hope we get Town 5 XP, that would be amazing, so we can grind up a little bit more. Town 6, I don't know, whatever. Town 6 might be a little bit too much, but Town 5 is pretty good as well. In you know, my opinion, though, personally. Personally, though, that's pretty good. Then, of course, um, then that we have Part 1 of the campaign, um, right here. I'm gonna check over really quick. Um, yeah, and then we have part one of the campaign. Of course, you know, we got all, um, lots of new stuff available. Um, specifically, though, of course, we had um, the Five Universal logos, we had movies and stuff like that. We had um, Demino down from eight to four hours, Drake Snow sales, typical stuff like that, of course. Um, new Bloma, like Blue Fluid event, we're basically doing um, farm up. You know, we can get um, a Bloma out with our, you know, machine stuff like that. You know, Blue Liquid, we had to fill that up. Every single play had to fill that up. We got the mission done, like, we'll, we'll get the mission done in about like a good day or two. That's really it. We got long boats, we can get this Goku. Of course, you know, 55 um, anniversary ticket banners, which I did not bring up, which I feel stupid about. Um, you know, we got five year summons and stuff like that. Um, special missions, stuff like that, blah blah blah. Redstone, which I do a video on. But anyway, yeah, I do videos on those. Um, new rank up packs and stuff like that for Google, those are really good. And of course, this is our ticket campaign banner, which is basically like, because at the time I know when this came out, we had like flat figures with like, you know, like Goku and like Illusion Blue Vegeta, all the dice was in Blue Vegeta. They all had like the big flat figures, and this um, banner was like, okay, let's just kind of do this. Um, we know more people have drill packs and stuff like that. Do a fest with forever LR, Blue Vegeta, and Gogeta. Blue Gogeta and Vegeta. New anniversary LR banner and stuff like that. This is the 50 50 ticket one. Again, I make videos for those already. Um, I don't even risk me that much time on those banners. They're just a good banner. It's five your coins. Um, the other five banner. Blue Fusion's, um, events. Boss Rush. New Dragon during most ages. We got like two or three though, like during this, and, um, campaign. Um, new skill orbs and stuff like that for the five anniversary. Um, new, new equipment and stuff like that coming to gold with is really nice. Um, Zero Morals Plan, and of course, Triple Saiyan, Day by Fate, um, thing. Um, New Freeze Exam, I remember that already. Battlefield, um, all these gates were open. Um, all the Patrol System Orbs were open, all the Future Trunks were open, Black Missions were back. But yeah, that's pretty good though. Part 1 was amazing though. A lot of people really love Part 1 and stuff like that. I am going to do a silly because I was like doing that. So I get some good confirmation and stuff like that, of course, for you guys. But yeah, um, Part 1 was already packed though. I didn't even know what to do first. I was like, should I go for Skill Orbs? Should I do this? Should I do that? Blah 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 blah. Um, but yeah, I can't remember what you had to do for skill orbs. I think it's like stage 50. I think you had to do the. I think it's like. No, I'm thinking the armor equipped. I'm thinking the particular potential system. We had to do like the um, Goku, the very first um, beginner Goku, we get the SR Goku that goes to Super Saiyan Angel Goku. Um, we had to do that in order to. Um, we had to do that in order to. Um, you do the potential system. You had to be ranked 50. Um, we did pretty good though. I think for Battlefield, we had to be like ranked something. I can't remember what it was. But yeah, that's part one though. Part two was. Um, and the part two and three were kind of our pretty short right here. Going over this really quick. I'm just going through these fast because the oh, hands got hurt a little bit right now. But of course, um, profile your logos, another new movie. Um, I think right here we have submission, blah 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 blah. Um, Dragon Zone sales, a new um, keep um, keep um, keep the, keep the secret Dragon Ball Hunt campaign. Basically, you can go here, get a free wallpaper from Dragon Ball Super Rolling movie, the Rolling vs. Gogeta, and for part two, I think we have um, the same missions like how about Turk with um, his energy and stuff like that. But basically, you can get like a free book, but um, it's also um, Tomaso vs. Um, Blue Vegeta wallpaper, so that was kind of cool though there. Uh, Global Special, you know, LR, um, friends, um, not LR friends, um, but yeah, um, a uh, buffed up Brace banner, right, essentially. We're basically, going to um, friends, um, put banner, you know, some get some other Kai's, Grand Kai's. I don't really recommend doing that because you're kind of wasting your friend points. Because when we get a new friend point, LR be like, oh yeah, I'm not a friend point, so I use this on his banner. Too bad, because Hell Celebration is probably going to have this as well. Um, I'm not going to have a part three um, update for the Goku Black Story event again. All you guys are getting updates and stuff like that, you know, easy area. We can definitely get that about the LR. Um, new LR, LR Top Summon banner, which is great, but Goba did but one Jimmy didn't know that much. And other Kai banner, though. Pretty good stuff for part two. Um, you know, it wasn't that much, though, but we got some pretty good stuff in the easy area for the rolling, um, rolling, um, kids to get, like, get right. It's, um, it's pretty good stuff for part two. I was like, okay, that's not bad, though. 
when we got part two, when we get to part three, oh, when that got leaked, everybody was like, oh my gosh. Um, okay, guys, I'm All back. Right. Um, I was gonna say, um, okay, my thing kind of crashed for a second there. Of course, I'm back though again. Um, yeah, like I was like I with before, um, part three, basically simple stuff as well. Just simple, simple, simple stuff. Um, I'm pretty much done with the video anyway at this point, so yeah. Of course, we got in the movie, logging bonus, special missions, blah, blah, blah. We got any for gold specifically, of course, they always kind of get this happening before. Which well, I think it's the first time gold probably doing this, you know, a little bit extra things, you know, extra um, tickets and stuff like that, coins, and the gold and stuff like that. It was extra tickets, they were being like really cool to check out in this piece. Um, yeah, that, that we got the new, of course, you know, fusion, you know, the fusion, um, red pump trunks, you can do it basically. We got energy, um, and we got trunks, stuff like that. Of course, one of those global JV things, we did that last year, I think, with the Omega um, EVA, you know, global had to have JP and vice versa, blah, 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 blah. In my opinion, I feel like that's what they did. So, yeah, um, that was that. Of course, super, super simple stuff like that. Of course, we got the Google Plus TVA area and some more Bobby Shop stuff and we have the Dragon Station. That's pretty much it. And the just blogging bonus screen stuff like that down there. Pretty simple stuff like that, of course. But yeah. Like I said, Fire University had a lot of good things for it. I feel like Fire did do a lot better, in my opinion, though. Like, it had more content, at least. Cause I remember there was a lot of things to do for Fire Year. I did a whole bunch of videos from those. And those were really cool. Um, overall. And of course, you know, hate number one and stuff like that. It's super simple as well. Um, but yeah, you know, I feel like definitely, um, Five year had um a little bit more, four year had a little bit more content than, did, than this did, personally, in my opinion. But yeah, overall, they did pretty good though. I mean, so stuff like that, we got almost over a thousand. Plus, you know, feel like thank you celebration, stuff like that. Um, no, thank you celebration, thank you stuff. Um, basically, you know, this first time global hit number one. Um, yep, so I did do videos for these, I've not uploaded those yet, but I will try to upload those as soon as I can. Of course, we got 100 Dragon Stones, um, Harko statues, keys, orbs. The same stuff global, J same stuff JP got right here, same as that stuff. Just got global, just got basically the keys points and um purpose edges early the ores were the same the stones were the same typical stuff for global um but yeah though um it was the price stuff like that they just switched over some stuff here and there they just switched that one over to this one um i think i just checked the jp prizes this is um thank you for this, um you know five anniversary stuff i love no basically when jb hit number one i think this one is what they very first got this is when jb hit number two i hit number one again i think for part two um this is how jp's was structured then i know there's one more down here as well um, yeah, Global Hit, yeah, I was hitting more with the right here. Um, I know like, there was, like, a third one, I think, for JP as well, but that was just a thank you stuff, like, right here. This is what it was, basically. So, Global, definitely, Global didn't get a chapter at all. I mean, just same stuff as well. Same stuff, Global guys. Thank you for, for the, um, celebrations, for that overall. A lot of people think Global was gonna get this, though, but typical stuff like that, of course, but yeah. Same stuff Global got. Um, Global got a little bit more, though, because of this, um, hang number one right here. So, one reason, I do a bit of story behind this, too. The only reason Global got, I mean, Global hit number one right here, because I did see, I, like, I think it was the first or second day. Um, uh, the first day I saw, like, a lot of Rosés already in El Village and Limbo. So, I was like, holy crap, people were actually something on the banner. Because, I mean, I kind of get that, though. You know, JP did something on the two. But I think JP, um, for JP, it was, it was another story because, um, at the time, JP was, um, I think, I, I think, like, um, a new game came out. It had, like, a crossover with, um, Demon Slayer. And it was like a Monster Strike or something like that, or Monster Hunter, or Monster, I think it was called Monster Strike and JP, because it's a popular JP Gacha game. Crossover, I think, with um, Demon Slayer, which I do like Demon Slayer, but I, really, I, really, I want to start getting back watching that. It's really good, though. I like it for what it is. Um, a lot of people don't really, I mean, I, say, I, I think one of my friends said he didn't like it, though, but I don't know. They're not getting debates for that, but yeah. That's, that's the only story, that's how JP didn't get hit number one, because I, I feel like JP could hit number one, but they didn't have, like, enough, you know, not money or anything like that. I feel like JP didn't, JP was like, okay, let's get kind of, we got close, but it's like, okay, my, uh, that crossover kind of came out, so I was like, okay, we kind of had to, you know, um, it was like, oops, sorry, um, yeah. So, yeah, JP, I feel like they could hit number one, but same thing, it was unfortunate, though, that, um, crossover was too much, I guess JP didn't get it in time, so yeah. What would you actually hit number one from that banner, though? Because I didn't see a lot of people summon for that banner. Trust me, if I could, if, trust me, if I had enough stones, which I do have enough stones, I could summon all these banners, but I wait for, like, the LOS to come back on specific banners, like, um, like the ticket bears and stuff like that, that's why I wait for LL to come back so I get it for free. I know I have to wait a long time, but I mean, they're not going anywhere, they're all still good to this day. So, yeah, LL Rose, when he comes back, like you know, for next year and stuff like that, is gonna be awesome. I'm gonna love that, though, of course. But yeah, though, but yeah, I'll try to upload this video as soon as I can, though. But yeah, that's pretty much it for the um campaigns and stuff like that for global. Another time, go to the unions and stuff like that, you know, typical stuff like that, always kind of go over. So, of course, too, we got the boy, um, Gogeta right here. Again, him and Vegeta are basically the same unit and stuff like that. They're both insane. They're both amazing. In the base rooms, they start to build up. But when they go all, they go all out in their blue form. Like, first turn, second turn, even, like, with one dupe, they still do, like, a whole bunch of damage. I have one dupe in mind. I've done some, you know, some show, not really showcases, though. But I've done some damage outputs. I might 
kind of deals with my Super Mario Show, those damage output and stuff like that. I never really do that type of thing, but I tend to. It is all in stuff linked below, on the app above, or whatever. But yeah, um, again, they're both, I think I love, I love about Gogeta and Vegeta specifically, um, Vegeta is um, pretty much the same thing anyway. They're both exactly the same unit, no matter what, there's no difference between them. Um, Vegeta basically gets, you know, Vegeta for, I mean, they're kind of the same unit though, but for Gogeta, he's effectively against all types, I think, in the third slot. And I think for Go, I think for Vegito, he does a double super attack. I want to say they're both number one. I want to say Vegito kind of hit it there a little bit because of that additional super attack can help out. I got three with him a lot of time. I got three or four with him in a row. Um, and I was like, and suddenly goes for Gogeta in Super Battle Road. Even if he was Super Battle Road, it might be hard, but the first stage I did, Gogeta was going insane. But yeah, I was gonna say though, um, I think about like about them though specifically, it's like okay, like if you don't have like reason, but if you pull go if you really want to go for both blue, blue, blue fusions, but you didn't get them, because they are gonna come back for Global in December. We don't know yet though, just November or December, you know, Tana Bada and stuff like that. That's gonna be for Global in November slash December. We don't know when that's gonna come out for that, but um we should maybe see it there. The good thing I like about them, because you can't get them both for five hundred blue points, they're gonna be back, they're gonna be back on Tana Bada Banner. But for Global though, I probably don't recommend something on it, but if you want to get the blue fusion there, go ahead. I was gonna say though, specifically. Um, I like them both because like they're both the same leader for the same category. They're both the um, yeah, leaders of the new same category. This is how you make a leader skill though, by the way, because you know you make it like okay, new category. Um, both the units, like for example, you know, maybe, maybe for example, you put Gogeta. Um, oh yeah, I put Gogeta. I keep um, um, category and stuff like that. But oh wait, I have more fusion cards. Okay, man, but I have a lot of Batara cards. Um, or you know, I have more fusion cards. But oh wait, I can also use that as well. Well, with fusion and trap final, like a lot of fusion cards are on trap final trump card anyway, so you're not gonna really kind of say that. But if you have like you know, non fusions and stuff like that, but hey, it certainly goes for Vegito the opposite. Like oh yeah, I have more you know, Batara units with me, or I have more fusion units. But I also, I also use final trump because they all look like, together somewhere like that. They all linked together though, they all do good damage again. Um, but that's what I really like about them both. They both are really good. Um, of course, that we got a new Goku Black LR again. He had the, like, you know, old evil transformation condition. I don't know why he's flying here. I'm gonna kill you. So bad out of this video. But yeah, um, Goku Black, we got a new LR for him though. I cannot wait. He's one of my, like, favorite arts LRs. Again, he played, again, I love Goku Black. So him, they come back for, um, you know, Ticket Bears or something like that. I'm gonna be ready. He basically takes, it's like medals and stuff like that, you know, with the Gogeta Vegeta event. You know, he takes, like, you know, the STR Rosen medals and the um, old one medals and the old medals. So yeah, I'm gonna start probably farming those events. But yeah. I'll use the final trump card because that team is insane. Like, that team can probably be any event, almost any event in the game. Because he's about to get super new super battle road as well, so yeah, that's gonna be insane. Of course, though, I was gonna say, um, um, him, he really is good. He has a rage mechanic and stuff like that. He's gonna do like a lot of damage. That's what he's built for. He's gonna give himself a lot. But yeah, he's gonna take a lot too because he's gonna um, grant the rest of defense for one turn. That's what Rosé cards usually they raise the attack or defense, um, or the lower attack and defense. And they get how about each, um, how about them more? So yeah, you're gonna like the whole book of black teams, Pizarro teams, and also teams. Probably hope like Evil Goku. You can run, you can run, um, um, the Easy and Birds Masu. You can run him. You could run as a friend or something like that because he has a future category, of course, um, Extreme Man. Um, you could run, which way for Extreme Man? I was like, okay, that makes sense. We are here to just run one. Make sure he's getting one too. So yeah, when he comes up for, like, when he comes up for the more tickets and stuff like that for the download celebration, maybe. Maybe a little bit too early though, but they're gonna be like, LR like LR Banner moving forward. So like the next LR Banner, like for down celebration, we're gonna probably see you know LR Vegeta or you know LR or, 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 Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta, whatever. You can see this guy definitely on that banner. He's gonna be awesome, nice, and beautiful. Again, I can get about this guy all day. I've done it before. He's amazing, awesome. I love this guy. Uh, probably like second favorite LR probably in the game. First LR bro tech Broly is between him and him. I love this guy. I need to have him like as my wallpaper for my background. I need to have him though. And of course, yeah, um, a new, another new LR, Broly, Chile, and Limo. Another gimmicky LR, which I do like about them, they're creative in a way, where basically, you know, they get um, a lot of physical orbs and stuff like that, their defense will go up and their keep will go up as well. But um, another gimmick, they have like STR or AGL orbs, you can have like uh, attack, or um, tech or anything like you have like uh, with defense, which I love that about them. And of course, they get seven or more orbs, they have great, they can dodge, they have 100% chance to dodge, and they get seven or more orbs. So that's really good though, of course, that's going to be really amazing, they're going to greatly raise their attack and defense for one turn, and the Mega Colossal and the regular Colossal are going to be really fine. Fits for on one turn. Again, they're all amazing. The really, teams are kind of limited because they're only really good movie bosses. It's not really joint forces, but they're really good, really good movie bosses. When they first got rebuilt, I was like, okay, that's a cute little LR they can do. That's kind of nice because we all have like a Chile and Limo. But they're, they're definitely going to be an LR, probably like, you know, probably Sharp LR. But yeah, these guys are LR really good. They're all like, they're kind of, it's like a cute Z little LR, which I do like though, about them. But yeah. Again, they are really made differently though. They're made completely differently. I love that about them. Hopefully, get more creative teams like this in the future. Like you know, um, I mean, that with Super Seventeen, he has like Goku Black units with um his EVA has all um with Goku, um with target Goku units. Um, they give themselves crit. He can help out with crit and stuff like that. That's kind of cool. Like you know, give everybody guard on the team. You know, we get like um AGL or you know, everybody gets guard. Get um attack stuff like that. You get attack defense. You know, lose attack defense or something like or you know like 
tech or, or something like that. I don't know, because they're kind of doing our ideas on it, though. That's cool. Of course, we got a new bar I can, um, I want to say, no, Goku Black EZA. This is from the very first LR Goku Black EZA. The first ever LR EZA, so for go, for go with Shitsu, Jutsu, Battle Realm. Maybe with the Killer Celebration coming up, maybe. I probably would say they wouldn't push all that early and go for like one big thing, but if you have like, you know, we'll probably get, get Explosive Chain Battle. Uh, probably get Chain Chain Battle Road. I think we got a Kepler Celebration. Um, but I don't know though. But yeah, quickly at the very first LR EZA Goku Black. I guess you like him so much as well. Again, I love Goku Black and stuff like that. Love him in the Geese. So I love his guy. I need to get his universe too. But yeah. Um, good for Goku Black though. Again, his very first LR EZA. We're gonna see Gohan get his EZA sooner or later. Super Battle Road probably Gohan. He's amazing as well. I've uh, we got the Gohan, you know, thing right there as well. But yeah. And he's a really good uh, LR stuff like that. Didn't change that much about him though. Him learning attack defense, raising attack and defense. This is why I put full additional for him so he can maximize his, you know, passing and stuff like that. But basically, you know, he gets, um, he does that stuff out the key and stuff like that, of course. Um, he can help him, stuff, him get more super attacks and stuff like that. I want to maximize that more. Basically, Super Battle Road, I really want to do that because the enemies hit hard and stuff like that. I uh, if I felt built for additional form so he can help out, you know, give more attacks, um, do more damage outputs and stuff like that. I want to, I want to see more. I want to go further beyond with this guy. I want to see how much he can hit. I want to go, I want to go full in depth with this guy. I want to go see how hard he can hit, what he can do, what he can do for us, stuff like that, help him out. Because when he can hit and stuff like that, um, he's gonna, um, you know, reduce, reduce damage a little bit and he's gonna also, um, up to six and stuff like that. And uh, with any attack received, he's gonna give himself key. So, yeah, like, he's gonna be doing a lot of damage and he's gonna give himself a lot of key as well. He's amazing. Good about him more. I'm not even talking about him anymore. So that, I think we got like a new Bardock in Gine right here, or Gine. Um, Gine or Gine. I'll, I'll always call me Gine. But yeah, they're pretty much good. They have a Goku on their team and stuff like that. And of course, they're gonna be good against a boss enemy. Or, you know, Prime or whatever. So, yeah, that's what they're basically kind of good for. And they have a really good actor skill like Beat Man. Art kind of sucks though, but I heard it's also good as well. I love their art though. I love their freaking art. And they had like aura or something like that more in the background. Like, this, again, you know, this art, I love this movie. That's really cool. In the Dragon Ball Super Broly movie. I love this movie. It was really good and awesome. But yeah. I like to say though, they are really good cards, stuff like that, you know, this, and Trunks of Mind just look good, it's good. I would say they are kind of a bit better, they are basically maybe for Super Battle Road, because of course, the, um, you know, they get their passive and stuff like that, you know, them getting a lot of, um, attack and stuff like that for their, um, active skill and stuff like that. Again, they're basically, if you're, um, if you like, I think, like, a Trunks or my, I think it's like, a Trunks or, um, I'm trying to think, I know they're good, if, okay, if, if you have, like, um, dang, yeah, they're gonna be good with the Blue Fusion, because Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan. Yeah, all Blue Vegeta's, all Blue, all blue units for that are gonna be good for them. Um, they're also gonna be good with, you know, fighting for the category enemy. But basically, they're made for a um, future Super Battle Road. They can't get hurt a lot with the Cell, um, um, cell one, but again, if you have, like, Physical Vegeta Blue, or SCR on um, Vegeta Blue, uh, Physical Vegeta Blue is gonna destroy that thing on its own. I basically did it all in one shot. When the Vegeta Blue guys EVA, I did it all in one shot. So, I had him, Glossy, Zamasu, the Ant Mai, I didn't have these guys yet, because they weren't things global yet. Um, there was more. I can't remember. Um, I think I had, like, Trunks of Mai, French Trunks of Mai. I think I had Goku Black's leader. Or if you go on, then I had Goku Black's the side lead. Again, Vegeta Blue carried the whole thing. But yeah, they're gonna be good with the extra skills and stuff like that. They are gonna kinda hurt themselves a lot. That was not, 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 not really much defense, but they are gonna be really good. Of course, we got some new EZA um, area, area units as well, and the Rats of Vegeta. They're pretty good though. Again, they may have, like, they have like a Pure Saiyans unit, or you know, um, on the team stuff like that, which you will have a lot though. Or I think if you're fighting a Drone Forces category, I mean, which you won't really see that much. But maybe in the. No, not Capitola. Um, no, I use a real like that, you know. They could be on drone forces, but you know, like two or more characters in the cars and stuff like that. Um, like Kepler, I mean, if you find like, you know, like, um, like, you know, kind of, like, if we get like an annual dual LR car, that's like two units and stuff like that, and one, um, what if we have like the LR and stuff like that, but, um, um, you can basically, you're not gonna really fight a drone forces enemy like that much, but, you know, I'm not gonna be like, oh yeah, all these characters like Kel and Khalifa separately, they should be on drone forces, you know, they join together and stuff like that. That would be kind of cool though, but it's only dual cards, so yeah, we're not gonna really see them. You're not gonna really see that for potential there. But they could already do good though. I'll probably take a full additional form because you can't easy hate them 100% for free and stuff like that. I probably would say though, um, they are really good though, of course. Um, Again, uh, they have like more pre on the team and stuff like that. They're gonna maximize that more. I was gonna say go full additional because they can't lower attack, so I won't say go full additional for that because they are gonna crit pretty much if we have like a pre on the category uh, as a team. So it's pretty good though. Of course, you got Broly and Ba. They're pretty simple as well. Or no, just Broly. It should be Kid Broly and Ba. I don't know why. So you know, keep, you know, cause you, for Vegeta and stuff like that, you can't get the SSR, but they kind of suck because that's the whole point. They're like, oh yeah, they suck. But when they wake and stuff like that, they're really good. I don't know why they could do that. But yeah, you know, he's only really kind of usable on pre Saiyans. He was not really because I tried to test him out on youth, but really didn't work that well but again the team kind of needs some good eight units all, all, overall team is amazing but they need probably more eight units though i mean maybe it's just me but the, they i mean no they just got a lot of good to go on for more tournament and um go on zda a lot of go on is pretty good for something like that yeah i'll, I'll go on um but yeah you know the team is good though the youth team is good pretty good 
Um, it does kind of feel limited a little bit though, but as I seen it now but yeah never no, no, open my eyes but he's gonna be good for dodging um tanking stuff like that pretty good though for them though of course you know doing fun program health and stuff like that so that's really good they probably won't do as much damage though in other events but they're still gonna be pretty good though for like you know grapple events and stuff like that they're gonna be really good but, yeah so we're gonna go today again though got some good stuff for the um L i mean all for the overall five anniversary with this one um but yeah um this is one Okay, yeah. Final anniversary was great for Global. We got lots of new games, lots of new stuff for that, of course. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and video here. Really good stuff for Global, though. Really, really, really good stuff for Global. Gonna go ahead and video here, though, really, though. Okay, that's Final anniversary overall. It's all all the stuff. Got, you know, LR oh, ticket banners and stuff like that. Make sure to defeat the ticket banner. By the time it goes up, it's probably the campaign will be over and stuff like that. So yeah, make sure to format everything. I'm gonna go grind up my rank right now. And though, you know, Dallas Celebration could have some more stuff later on. But yeah, Global's gonna have a good pack celebration with Kefla. Um, so yeah, I mean, JP's gonna be kind of quiet for a couple days for Global. Maybe some good stuff. I know, I think Legends got Ultimate Gohan and stuff like that, so we could see that a little bit later. But yeah, um, I think that's it. guys there, though. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. Yeah. I'll go do it again, though. Gonna go ahead and video here. Pretty good stuff, though, of course. Yeah, see you guys there, though, again, though. Peace out.